YouTube, welcome back to another video. Today, I got my week seven NFL schedule predictions. Last week, we went six out of six. That is embarrassing. Embarrassing. This week, we're going to bounce back, and I'm only getting one wrong. One wrong, and that's it. Why do I have a Yankee jersey on, you're wondering? Because my team is moving on to the ALs, baby. The AL championship. One round away from the freaking Super Bowl. World Series, one win away from the, no, seven, it's a, it's a seven game series, best out of five, you understand, bro, if you don't know baseball, I, I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not explaining, okay, just know, Yankees will win, okay, Astros have nothing on us, so let's get in to my week seven predictions, starting off, we have the Colts versus the Titans, this is gonna be a good game, um, Jonathan Taylor's back, but it's going to come down to who has a better running back. The Titans. The Tennessee Titans have a better running back. They will get the job done. They will beat the Colts this weekend. Moving on, we have another divisional game. The Ravens versus the Browns. And listen, if I'm not mistaken, I'm happy. My two favorite quarterbacks in the NFL are going against each other. The two best quarterbacks in the NFL should be going against each other. Deshaun Watson should be back this week. I think he was suspended for seven weeks, just like Hopkins. If I'm not mistaken, Hopkins should be back this week. Um, But if I'm wrong, if Watson plays, I have the Browns winning, okay? If Watson plays, I have the Browns winning. But if Deshaun Watson does not play, I have the Ravens. My Ravens will beat the Browns this week. So it's all up to Deshaun Watson. Watson is the second best quarterback right now in the NFL behind Lamar Jackson. Um, if he plays, I got Browns winning. Simple as that. But if he doesn't play, Ravens should beat the Browns. Jacoby percent is not good, okay? Jacoby percent is not good. That defense is not good. Deshaun Watson's going to go crazy. It's, I mean, I mean, it's going to be over. But I would love to see Watson and Lamar go against each other. They're the two best in the NFL. They're demons. I love them. Moving on. We have the Raiders going against the Texans. Wow. I'm not going to lie. I think the Texans have a better record than the Raiders right now. I think the Texans have a better record than the Raiders. Doesn't matter. I've been making um, like 2000. I got Raiders. Raiders should win that, okay? I want to fuck, 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 fuck the shit shit out of Carly Hazel. Bro! Uh, the Raiders should beat the Texans. Right, listen, I'm calling it now. The Raiders will win the division. I called it. Either the Chargers or the Raiders will win their division. You niggas in trouble. You niggas in trouble. I don't listen. And if you think I'm capping, if you have not looked at the Raiders' schedule, it, it, I mean, I mean, I mean, sorry to tell you, but they are one and four. Listen, they're one and four. They're gonna beat the Texans. They're two and four. They're gonna beat the Saints. They're three and four. They're gonna beat the Jaguars. They're four and four. They're gonna beat the Colts. They're five and four. Beat the Broncos six and four. Beat the Seahawks seven and four. Beat the Chargers eight and four. Beat the Rams nine and four. Beat the Patriots ten and four. Beat the Steelers and eleven and four. Beat the 49ers twelve and four. Lose to the Chiefs twelve and five. Beat the Raiders have the Dolphins and Falcons over the Bengals and Gaines over the Jags and Seahawks over the Chargers and Chiefs over the 49ers and Patriots over the Bears and Buccaneers place in the AFC West. You niggas in trouble. You niggas in trouble. That's my prediction. Raiders beat the Texans. They have an easy schedule. 12 and 5. Um, they lose one more game this season. We have the Jets going against the Denver Broncos. Let's start with the Jets. Jets, y'all are good. Jets are a playoff contender. Um, Jets, I have nothing but respect for y'all. Y'all are a good team, okay? Broncos on the other hand. Let's start at the quarterback position. Russell Wilson, I have defended you, okay? I had you in my top five quarterbacks right now in the NFL, number four. You were the fourth best quarterback on my list. Not anymore. I'm ready to take you out and put Josh Allen in. Oh, my God, bro. Oh, hell, hell no, man. What the fuck, man? Josh Allen has taken your spot in the top five quarterbacks in the NFL right now. Russell Wilson, oh, my, oh God. 15 passing yards in the second half is crazy. It's crazy, bro. I average 15 yards a play. 
That's me at quarterback. I averaged 15 a play. And you do that a half. That is, it's embarrassing. Broncos, free Melvin Gordon. You don't deserve him. He's a good running back. Free Jerry Judy. Send him to Baltimore. Send him to a quarterback that will get him the ball. Jerry Judy, free him. Um, But yeah, Broncos, not gonna lie. Y- y'all are not good. Y'all are not good. Jets win. Jets win. Um, Yeah, bye-bye, Broncos. Ugh, I mean, it's crazy, bro. Get a better quarterback. Get a better uh, quarterback. All right, moving on. We have the Steelers versus the Miami Dolphins. So, is anyone even going to watch this game, honestly? Bro? Like I said, Steelers versus the Miami Dolphins. This is the battle of mid. This is the battle of mid. Mid versus mid. <laughs> wow. Wow. I'm not going to lie. No one's going to watch this game. No one's going to watch this game. Um. Yeah. These are the two teams I hate the most in the NFL. I don't like the Steelers, don't like the Dolphins, don't like the Bills. Top three teams I don't like in the NFL. Um, but I got to be unbiased. Be unbiased. Who's going to win? All right. Not going to lie, both of these teams are probably the two worst teams in the NFL. Two is back. I don't care. Two is mid, too. Um, Dolphins have a better defense. Boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. But Steelers have a better offense. Oh, God. Dolphins got better defense. That one right there made me the Steelers got a better of offense. That's what I feel. I'm not gonna lie. This game's ending in a tie. <laughs> this game's ending in a tie. Three to three. It's mid versus mid. I'm not gonna lie. TJ, all right. TJ Watt is back. Good. T, all right, all right. TJ Watt's back. Two is back. They're all mid. You niggas in trouble. You niggas in trouble. Mid versus mid, it's ending in a tie. Yes, Moving on, we have eggs the and ham. Falcons Mostly versus because the teacher had you read most of it. Falcons versus the Bengals. All right, let's go over these two teams. Bengals versus Falcons. Quarterback, Joe Burrow or Mariota? Joe Burrow. Running back, Joe Mixon. Cordell Patterson, Joe Mixon. Uh, receivers. Bengals got a better offense, but the Falcons have a better defense. You're the real MVP. Okay? This game is at Cincinnati. Okay? That's gonna give them the upper hand. I have the Bengals beating the Atlanta Falcons. It's gonna be a close game. Gonna be a close game. Um, yeah. I'm uh, moving on. We have the Giants versus the Jaguars. Giants versus the Jaguars. Um, this is gonna be a good game. But Giants, respect to y'all. Y'all should not have beat us. <laughs> y'all should have not have beat us. Um, I have the Giants winning this week. Giants will win. Giants will win. Um, Giants look good this year. Moving on. We have the Seahawks versus the Chargers. Oh my God. Chargers, what the fudge was that last night? You barely beat the Broncos. Herbert, I thought you were like a top 10 quarterback. No, you're not top 10, Lil Bro. Boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. You're not top 10. Mike Williams, you're not good. Chris Harris, okay. Um, yeah, Chris Harris, bro. Really? Mike Williams. You had two catches last night. Two catches. Chris Harris, Champ Bailey, whoever was guarding you last night, they boxed you. How do you get boxed by a random? Come on, bro. Never heard of Champ. Never heard of Chris Harris. You got, you, 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 honestly, you got boxed. Two catches is crazy. Herbert, you're mid, okay? Uh, that Chargers defense, I love it. J.C. Jackson's a top five corner. Uh, Khalil Mack's probably the best edge rusher in football right now. You niggas in trouble. You niggas in trouble. That char- that, 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 that defense carried you last night, okay? But you're playing the Seahawks. Seahawks. They're not good. Chargers win. Not Moving on. We have the Chiefs versus the 49ers. All right. Chiefs versus the 49ers. Um, uh, yeah. Is this even a debate? Patrick Mahomes is going against a terrible defense. Yeah, that's free. That's free. That is free. Chiefs win. We have the Bears versus the Patriots. I'm not going to lie. Mac Jones, your time is up in um, New England. Your time is up. Um, Patriots win with their new quarterback. Uh, Bailey Zapp. 
Bailey Zap got a team How about the Yankees? Um, also, Cody would like to fight hey, little girls for fun. Hey, I mean, I mean, he's the franchise quarterback now. Matt Jones is up on the trade block. Patriots, trade him to somebody. Bra Saints versus the Cardinals. Both of these teams are coming off a bad loss. Hold up, finally we got a good Thursday night matchup. Finally, 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 finally. We have one of the best defenses in the NFL going against one of the best offenses in the NFL. Yes. Can you name a better offense than the Cardinals? Can you, chat? Can you? Yes, DeAndre Hopkins back. Think about that. D-Hop is back. Can you name a better offense than the Cardinals right now? You niggas in trouble. Niggas in trouble. Honestly, I couldn't. Honestly, I couldn't. The Ravens don't even have a better offense than the Cardinals. Could be a good game. Big Thursday night game. Saints have a really good defense. Top five defense. Cardinals have the best offense right now in the NFL. You niggas in trouble. You niggas in trouble. So, it's going to be an offense versus defensive game. It's going to be crazy, okay? I have the Cardinals bouncing back. Cardinals win on Thursday night. All right, moving on. We have the Lions versus the Cowboys. Oh, it's over. GG's. GG's. If the Cowboys are on your schedule, it's over. It's over. You lost. Yep, Dak is back. Dak is a top five quarterback. Cowboys are a good team. They're fully healthy. Zeke is back. It's over for the NFC. If the Cowboys are on your schedule, it's over. Y'all lost. Cowboys win this weekend. Washington versus the Packers. Gonna be a good game. Uh, Packers are coming off two L's against two mid-franchises. Mid-New York teams. It's kind of crazy. How do you lose to the Jets? How do you lose to the Giants? Aaron Rodgers. Done What's embarrassing. W Rodgers, w let's get something going. Aaron Jones, you are eating me. You are eating me in fantasy. What are you doing? Honestly. Giants doing, own the right? rave. Packers bounce back this week and beat the Washington Commanders. All right, moving on. We have a battle of the NFC South. The battle of the NFC South. The Bucks taking on the Panthers. Um, battle of the NFC South. If I'm not mistaken, winner of this game takes first place in the NFC South. Um, Bucks just lost to the Steelers. Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Uh... What happened? Uh... Are the Bucks even good anymore? Their defense is terrible. Tom Brady, I don't know what you were doing, little bro. Um, yeah, I'm going Panthers beat you. Panthers beat you. Why? Why do I say this? Cause Robbie Anderson is gone. Robbie Anderson was the problem. They Bucks just lost to the Steelers. How are the Giants Simple. not a play? Pan Panthers beat the Bucks. Uh, Robbie Anderson was the problem. There we go. That's my week seven picks. Hit that like button. Hit that sub button. I'll see you in the next video. Mwah.